Hello, Berryessa community, and welcome to the 2019-20 school year. As we think about ways that we can continue to foster positive relationships and a nurturing environment for our students, let's listen to their thoughts on who they are and what makes a school a great place to learn and grow. Could you share with me something that you would like your new teacher to know about you? I just like learning and I like to read a lot and I like getting homework. <laughs> How to say everything about me properly. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. It, it matters, right? It's who you are and you want everybody to get that right. Can you share with me what is a way that you like to learn? Some, mostly visual because it's like you can see it more better than just on paper. Mm -hmm. To make learning more fun, we could work with friends. How can we show others kindness? Mm. No sticking their tongues out. Hugs. And? And caring about each other. In second grade, um, we use fist bumps for, you know, mm -hmm. saying hello. Mm -hmm. We don't use welcome, mm -hmm. we use fist bumps. Yeah, you like a secret handshake, huh? Yeah. Very good. Don't be a bully. So tell me about the web program. Um, It's mostly for like sixth graders when they just come into middle school and they need someone to talk to. Like they don't know how the school works, so that's mm -hmm. where we help. So if we could make your school a more welcoming place for everyone, what could we do? Um, a more welcoming place? I would think that I go to middle school, so I've seen that we focus on the sixth graders, which is good. I like that we focus on the sixth graders and we focus on the eighth graders. So there's that missed grade mm -hmm. called seventh grade, mm -hmm. and it's the in seventh grade, there's so many things that people accomplish. So if we kind of welcome the seventh graders a bit more and we focused on some of the new students mm -hmm. and not just the sixth graders. Okay, thank you, great suggestion. Can you share with me something that your teacher could do in the classroom to make learning more fun? Being more social with them and um, being a fun teacher. Mm -hmm by making the activities fun. Can you share with me um, what you would like to do when you get older? Be an engineer. Be an astronaut, but I know I have to learn a lot of math to do that. But if that doesn't work, uh, maybe a plane pilot. Okay. Someone who makes a video game. I just really love technology. Mm -hmm. I would want to have the job of testing out the video games. Oh, that would be fun. what's more fun than getting to play video games <laughs> every day, all day? Exactly. I want to be an artist or maybe like a chef or a movie star or something. Great. Um, my dreams are to become a teacher and help the next generation excel. What do you love about your school? My principal. And what makes her special? Well, she's a very nice principal. And how did she show you that she's nice? Like she doesn't yell at people whenever mm -hmm. they like get in trouble that much. Mm -hmm. Teacher. Why? Because she's been teaching us for, for the past 180 days. She actually gave us a lot of surprises when it was near the last day of school. Okay. I want to thank Miss Peters because she always helped me when I had trouble learning things and she explained them to me so I would understand who would be Miss Katai. She is really, really nice because her sister will sometimes come over and bring us ice cream. Mm. I would like to say thank you to the cross guards for letting us pass by and helping you be safe. Very good. I'd like to say thank you to my principal because she does a lot of things for us. Great. And what's her name? Mrs. Ortiz. Excellent. Mrs. Jacobo, um, the web teacher. 
for like just being there. Uh, I would like to thank my teacher and my principal because they keep my school running. Okay, very good. I don't really have a favorite. It's kind of like picking your favorite child. <laughs> <laughs> so then you think everyone's great at your school? Can you tell why it's so special? Because they've just helped me learn and go forward with my life. Okay, great. That's a wrap.